Fish on. Fish on. Ooh, that's a big one. What's up, guys? We've come out to Colorado, and we're at Rampart Reservoir. Absolutely phenomenal looking as far as the scenery goes. I'm from Texas, and I know that these fish here in Colorado are going to be a lot craftier than the ones I'm used to catching. But we've got our gear. We're ready to go, so let's see what we get. Check that out. It's like a little drainage canal, probably to prevent severe erosion, but we're going to use it as a shortcut. So we're just going to walk down here. Make sure not tangle our gear on everything all the way down. Really cool. All right, guys, let me show you what I'm using. I've got the Bass Pro Shops Microlite Elite Rod and Reel. It's a five foot six inch rod. It's rated for two to eight pound line and uh, lures up to a fourth an ounce. Our underspins, my absolute favorite bait for, for most freshwater fish. And normally I would tip that with a soft plastic, but today I'm going with a bit of a live worm. So here's what I do. I like to hook it near the top, not, not in the opening that I've broken, but near that. Go down about the length of the hook shank, maybe a bit more. And before I, before I shove it up on the hook shank, I like to turn it around on itself and hook the worm a second time. And that way, it holds position much better. The worm doesn't go sliding down the shank. And you end up with a really, really good bait. And this is something I've used with regular jig heads for all kinds of panfish, but the spinner being tipped with a, a big piece of live night crawler really seems to be doing the job for these trout today. Guys, we just gotta follow. We just gotta follow from a trout. A dark trout. Could have been a brown trout. Just followed it. He turned off it at the last second, as they do. It makes me very, very confident about what we're doing here. Oh my God, he's following it again. Okay, here's what we're gonna do. I'm getting a follow, but no bite. So I'm gonna switch over to our natural bait because when I drop that lure, he's following it. When I drop it so he can catch it, it kind of turns him off. Whereas with a, a bit of natural bait on the end, maybe that'll drive him over the top. Dropping this one straight down. Fish on, fish on. Rainbow, rainbow trout. What a beautiful animal. What a beautiful animal. I'm down here to get my hands wet. Wow. Oh, oh, there he goes. He turned himself loose. Incredible, incredible, incredible fish. Incredible fish. I'm glad we got our hands wet before touching him. He got off the hook, but he did it right at the water's edge. So I'm fine with that. I'm fine with that. All right, that's what did the business. Worm on a spinner. And I believe this rock has a bit of an undercut so a fish could literally be sitting underneath us right now. And I jigged this down, and this is what got him. I don't know how many are down there. Could have just been the one.
Yep, 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 yep. There's one following it. There's several down there. Oh my god, there's several down there fighting over it. There's three or four trout right here in front of me. Fish on. Fresh bait. All right, guys, let's see if we can draw them in from that rock. All right, stay low. Watch, they follow from out there. They'll chase it from out there. If you guys are wondering who I'm talking to, my wife is with me. What is this? What is this? What is this? Oh, a stick. Oh no, look, it's somebody's fishing line. Some of these a whole mess of braid and a couple of different hooks, my goodness. Let's get all this out of here. We'll take this back up with us. It's a mess. Okay. Man, I thought that was a big trout. <laughs> All right, we're sinking it down right at the edge of the rock. Fish on, fish on. Ooh, that's a big one. Oh man, that's a good one. Look at that guys, beautiful rainbow trout. Now these guys are throwing the hook the moment, the moment they're slack, they're throwing the hook. So we gotta be very, very careful. There we go. Get our hands nice and cold in the water. Beautiful rainbow trout. What an amazing fish. Fish of the day, this one. This is a good one. Guys, that's gonna do it for us today. Couldn't have asked for a more beautiful spot on a more beautiful day. And we caught some really beautiful fish. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe to the channel. Hit the bell and all that good stuff. Check out the Patreon page and check out our other channel, Wildlife Outdoor Cooking. You can find the link to those all in the description of this video. More is coming guys, stay tuned. And until it's here, I will see you guys later.